Hey there, Jeremy. This is Victor again. Very glad that we got to talk over Messenger. This is just a quick little video on what you can do to get more customers and leads coming to your oil change services and especially extend your online presence because um, obviously extending your online presence increases the amount of people you can reach and more people you reach, the more customers you have. So this video honestly is free advice, Jeremy. So I don't want to overload it with too much information. So if you have any questions whatsoever, reach out to me. Jumping straight into it. Here is a little tool called Keyword Surfer. It uh, tells me how many people are searching for something per month. And so, for example, oil change in Boise, it tells me there are 880 searches per month looking for that. In other words, those are 880 potential customers looking every month for oil changes in Boise for places to do their oil change. And the first place they will find you is here in the Google Maps and here in the organic results where your website is listed. Now, everyone is familiar with Google, Jeremy, but honestly, what most people do not know is that at minimum, 75% of clicks go to the first page. In other words, most of these 880 uh, potential customers aren't even going to look past these three or look past these uh, organic results. They're not even going to go to the second page. So it shows how vital it is to not only be on the first page, but to be the top results so that those 880 potential customers not only find you, but find you first, especially before these guys and any of these websites. And so first of all, these potential customers will find you here in the organic results. Sorry, in the Google Maps where you are you have your Google Maps listing. And um, what you call it? I found your Google Maps listing separately when I searched for you directly, but I did not find it when I simply searched up oil change in Boise. So my first recommendation is get your address onto your Google Maps listing. When you put your address on there, it shows whenever somebody looks for oil change in Boise, your address will show up for them to go to. So my first recommendation is that. And what, after that is that done, the first thing you should know is that what you call it, these 100, 880 potential customers are going to find these top three before anybody else. And most of the time, they're going to click on these three listings. Now, it's not, not many people know this, but it's not location necessarily. They get you to the top of Google Maps, but it's something called citations. Now, use a little tool called WhiteSpark that helps me see how many citations, especially this guy, Babylon Instant Oil Change gets, that gets him to the top. And not only does it tell me how many citations uh, he has, right there, it said, uh, I believe it was 20. Yeah, not only does it tell me how many citations he has and how many you would need on your Google Maps listing to beat him, but we can get some of the same citations as well. So in other words, um, after you get, after you put your address here onto your Google Maps listing, which will then allow your listing to show up on this listing right here, it will be very easy to just boost some citations to get you above uh, these three right there. So very easy to get you to the top of Google Maps. The second place these 880 potential customers will find you is here in the organic results. And um, I took a, it's pretty much where your website is listed. And I took a look through your website. Honestly, it's fine. It's simple. It's straight to the point. And that's actually the best part. A lot of customers like websites that's just straight to it. No, no pretty much crap on the side that's uh, unnecessary. However, the problem is with your website. When, uh, let's see here. Looking for Boise oil change. Your website is number 22 in the Google Maps. In, in the Google results. So in other words, your website is 22nd in place of all the websites. So anybody who's looking up for oil change in Boise are going to find at least 21 other sites before yours. Number one right now is Yelp. And second one is also Yelp. And third one is uh, Einstein's Oilery. And Yelp being at the top, everybody knows how big Yelp is and how hard it is to beat them because they're a huge agency. Well, guess what? It's very easy to beat Yelp, actually. The two things that put Yelp, especially this page, on the first result right there is two things, content and backlinks. Content just means they have more words or more information on their site. In other words, looking at your site right here, I'd recommend, first of all, putting some more content, putting some more words, and putting some more information. The second thing that this Yelp page is having that um, these other guys don't really have is backlinks. Backlinks just means the number of links coming back to their site. Now I use a tool called Majestic that helps me see how many links are coming back to this Yelp page. And looking at their numbers here, very, very low. So in essence, 
increasing some backlinks to your site allows you to boost your site to yes and it's possible to even outrank yelp so in other words those anybody who google searches uh, for oil change in boise they are going to find your site before yelp and they will find your google maps listing before any of these guys in any of your other, other competitors so in essence Jeremy, i'm just going to be straightforward here it's very easy to get you to the top of google maps and organic results so that you, those 880 potential customers not only find you but find you first and so obviously there's more factors than this such as the different types of backlinks keywords social media ads google ads which will help you with as well but like i said this video is just free advice i don't want to overload it with too much information so if you have any questions whatsoever feel free to reach out to me